Hey, Dave here again. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to import multiple leads using CSV files or Excel or whatever you wanna call them. Now, before I get into it, I'm gonna ask you every time, if you haven't done so, please like, subscribe, and share this because sharing is caring. I put these videos out only to help everybody use Lofty to their fullest potential. I'm a Lofty user for over eight years. Um, I started when I was with Chime, so it's an amazing company. I'm here to help you, so let's get rocking. It's really important, so especially if you've just gone from a different brokerage or you just signed up for Lofty and you have a whole Excel spreadsheet of leads that you want to import in here, Lofty has you covered. Same thing, go to People. Instead of adding lead, you go to the three dots, Import Lead. Now it's going to ask you to find your CSV, so you can either drag it over or I'm going to upload a file so you can kind of see it. So we'll do... So you hit open, it's gonna do this little fancy stuff. Then it's gonna pull in information. Now, don't be afraid that there's not all of your leads are showing up. So I'm only gonna show you two leads, but it will be importing all of the leads, all right? So the nice thing is, is you don't have to do this for every two leads, it's just showing you what they will look like as you import this. The little green check marks means yes, it's it, they, they match up. So what you wanna do is go through and make sure they, they match up. Now, sometimes though, this one does match up because this is actually a lofty download and I uploaded in here, so everything's gonna match. But you may not match up with something from let's say top producer or follow up boss. You can just click on this actually on the, on the word and you can scroll down and find what you want to match it with, okay? Now, when you go through and let's say, um, I don't want this to be uploaded, you can just click that and say, do not import. Boom, there you go. Also too, when you when you pull this up and if they don't have the green marks, but you don't care that if it's not being imported, then you don't have to do anything with it. So let me repeat that because I don't explain things well sometimes. If you have, let's say family member, family member three's email, you don't care if that's in there and it looks and this green check mark is, is gone, then don't worry about it. Only worry about the check, you want the green check marks of the things you want uploaded into the system. Now, advice do this before you click next so many times people go down through and like oh, i'm just going to test it out and they click next and it's a pain in the ass to go back and fix this so before you click next make sure you go through comb it through make sure everything is what you want to import and then you're going to click next from here again you, you may or may not have the setting depending on if you're a team leader or on a team or whatever a brokerage you're at but here um, segments, this is just if you want to put them in a certain segment of your, of your um, if they're all buyers or sellers or whatever, but no segment here. Assigned, whatever, you're, probably yourself, or if you're a team leader, you can drop down, you can pick an agent. There we go. If, there's, if you have a lender on board, fantastic. Um, duplicate leads, um, skip leads, and a little question mark here, it kind of explains what it is. And then permission to contact. Again, if this list is pe of people that have you've already given you permission to contact them, if they've signed up on your website, whatever, put yes in all of these. If these are just cold leads that you got bought a lead list somewhere, make sure they're no, because if you want you want to be compliant. And when this is all said and done, you click I agree and import. I'm not going to because these are already duplicate leads, but that is how you import a mass list of leads. Now, before you even go forward and worry about anything else, make sure your leads are imported. This is why it's less than seven, not less than 20, because I want you to make sure your leads are in there because that's what makes you money. So again, please like, subscribe, and share. Watch my videos. If you're curious about how to do a manual, just one lead at a time, I already did a video, and that's less than six. Have a great day.